Hi, this is a brief video to explain the differences between plan and enroll through your student self-service. So I already have sh classes in my shopping cart. So if I click on student self-service and click on plan, uh, my classes are in the summer 2021 semester. So I can go ahead and click on that, then continue. And it shows me both of the classes that are in my shopping cart. Okay, so from here, if I just want to enroll in one class, I can just go ahead and check that off. If I want to register in both classes, I can check both of them off. Uh, if I want to delete a class, all I have to do is make sure that the class is selected and then press delete. If I wanted to look at classes in a different term, I can click on change term and go to fall. And it's going to go ahead and pull up the fall semester. Now, I only have one class in my shopping cart. So again, if I want to delete the class or enroll, I can just highlight the class press either delete or enroll and follow the directions on the screen to finish enrollment. If I go back to student self-service and click on enroll, it's going to be a little bit different. So I'm going to go to the summer 2021 semester, press continue. Now, right now, it doesn't give me the option to enroll in either one class or both classes. Okay, so that's going to be the difference. Um, my options here are just to proceed to step two of three of the enrollment or I can go ahead, if I want to, delete one or both of these classes in my shopping cart. So if I go through this option, it's going to attempt to register in both of these classes. Now, with either option, if you uh, have a prerequisite error, that's fine. The enrollment won't process, okay? So you'll get a red X. If everything is successful, you'll go ahead and you'll get a green check mark. So if I go to step two of three, with either option, you're going to get the fee liability statement, uh, basically states that you're responsible for paying for the classes after the UCF drop period. I accept, continue enrollment, okay, confirm that you want to go ahead and register for these classes, and then select finish enrolling. These classes have been added to my class schedule. The status is a green check mark. If I go back to my student self service, uh, they're currently on the schedule for the summer 2021 semester. If I want to go ahead and drop any classes, I can do that from the other academic drop down menu and go to enrollment drop or withdraw. So uh, we're still well before the add drop swap deadline. So I would be dropping the class. I would go to the summer 2021 semester. And then from here, I can go ahead and highlight which classes that I want to go ahead and drop. Both of these uh, classes have been removed from my schedule. They have been dropped. I am not fee liable. Uh, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to an academic advisor. We would be happy to help.